what's going on everybody i've got the uh the sea stream angler 120 pd rapid pedal drive um we're going to go over some some quick maintenance tips uh a video that i was not able to locate on youtube anywhere uh i actually reached out to the guys at waterways us in Asheville. Check them out on their website, Waterways US. Uh, check out Seastream or any one of the feel free family of kayaks and boats. Great group of people. Uh, but there is no real guide on how to maintain the rapid pedal drive system. So we're going to go over that. You see a need for something, you do it. That's what I'm going to do. So the first thing these are these screws or hexes <clears throat> these are six millimeter this is the same exact one that came with uh the kayak but you notice it fits here fits here fits in here it fits I'm gonna take it back. It doesn't fit in there. Okay. I know. I know that they're looking at making a uh, a tool to do this. But after every trip, or actually, sorry, before every trip, tighten these. <clears throat> tighten the screws on the on the pedals themselves. I just tighten those. That's why they're tight. This is a six millimeter. This is the one that comes with it. This we'll get to in a moment. Always check. See, that one's kind of loose. Always check your, your drive. in much need of some water therapy. I know those are supposed to be kind of loose. If I remember right. Yeah. Alright. So, now down to the part everybody really turned in to find out. <clears throat> exactly how do you go about greasing this thing because it is a chain drive you got to grease it so what i'm going to do i'm going to start this is bike lubricant bike chain lubricant uh all conditions this is a low viscosity a low viscosity uh spray i'm just going to spray it on the cranks the the, the key is low viscous you want a low viscosity. Spray that on there. And we can bring the drive up. Crank it around a couple times to make sure that everything there is. And then pull the drive out. I'll set it sideways. So there's two screws that you got to pull out. This one here. I'm going to get that one loose. And then this one down here. Don't lose them. Is that one there? That one there. All right. So you pull those out. You can see 
that's already got some oil in it. This, I'm gonna, tap, I'm gonna try this. Easy lube, white lightning, easy lube. It's another bicycle chain lube. Just best for riding in dry conditions. Well, the good news is the entire inside of this drive is sealed. So, let's. I shook well. Put some in there. Put some in there. Just a little bit. Goes a long way. Put the screws back in. I really need to make a bench for this. <sighs> Tighten these screws back down. And these Allens are the ones that you want with you on the water, in the boat at all times, because these are the ones that matter the most. There you go. It's not super tight. Should be tight enough for what we want to do. Get that grease cranking around in there. Forwards and backwards. Because it's a chain drive the more you use it the quieter it will get so that's how that's how you maintain your sea stream angler rapid pedal drive it also works on the uh the three waters big fish kayaks but thanks for checking in we will see you guys later